Hello, this is Snippers with Shay. I am here today to talk to you about the verse in Mark chapter 9, 23 through 24. When the man cried out, he said, Lord, I believe, but help my unbelief. There is a difference between ignorance and a deliberate choice. There is a difference between doubt and unbelief. Ignorance you don't know or understand about a matter. A deliberate choice you do know. You know what you're doing and you make the choice to either do something or not to do something. Doubt is a matter of the mind. You can't grasp it as of yet. It takes place when we may not understand what God is doing or why God is doing. Have anybody ever been there? I have a lot of times. But unbelief is a matter of our will. It is a choice that we make. We have free will to make choices. But I want to tell you today that the man that cried out, Lord, I believe, but help my unbelief, it's not that he didn't believe in Jesus. He believed in Jesus. But there was part of him that didn't fully trust. Sometimes we have doubt when we don't fully trust. I don't always know what God is doing. You're not going to always know what God is doing or why. He doesn't seek our knowledge about certain things. God is God. He's sovereign. We just have to learn to trust him. We just have to learn to get rid of the doubt and do like the man did. Cry out to Jesus and say, Lord, I believe, but help my unbelief. Help me in the places that I don't fully trust you, in the areas of my life that I don't fully trust you. So I just want to say to you today, if you haven't made the choice to believe, I'm asking you today to please make that choice, to believe in Jesus, the Son of God, because it's better to believe than to gamble with your eternal life, to end up to not believe and then end up in hell and find out that it was everything was true. Everything was real. That heaven is real. Hell is real. And you made the choice to not, the, not the deliberate choice to not to believe. And you end up in hell. I don't want that to happen to you. So I'm saying today, give your life to Jesus. Ask him to come into your heart and help you to believe. And if you do believe, ask him to help your unbelief and to help you to trust him in every area of your life. I love you. This is Snippets with Shay. See you later.